Today, we will be discussing Doclink approvals using email links in the Doclink web application. As an organization's approver, you may have many invoices to approve throughout the day. The process of getting an invoice, manually approving it, and then sending it back to accounts payable is cumbersome and time consuming. Not approving documents on time can also lead to missed deadlines, no early pay discounts, and late fees. But with Doclink, the process is streamlined into an efficient, automated process. We will start with an invoice coming into an organization for the first time. For simplicity, we will use a non-PO based service invoice. The invoice will first be seen by Accounts Payable, where they will use Doclink to GL code the invoice. This invoice data is burned into the document and the data will flow from this point going forward to eliminate double entry of data. When Accounts Payable is ready, they can click a button to send the invoice to an approver. Once sent, Doclink will send out an email notification to that user, letting them know a new invoice is ready for their approval. The user will see the notification, look at the document with the GL coding, and click on Approve or Deny depending on their choice. When this happens, Doclink does two things. One, as a digital signature to the document indicating that user has approved the document, and two, moves the document to the preset status, in this case approved. This is a simple, effective way to have users throughout the organization approve or deny documents without ever logging into Doclink. Accounts Payable will then be able to see the document with approval in their approved for payment status, where then Doclink can pick up an invoice on a regular interval and batch import it into the payables transaction. This can be done without ever logging into or re-entering data into the ERP system. Now let's say you didn't want to use email for approval and we want to force users to log in and approve from Doclink instead. We will again send a document after it has been GL coded to the approver. This will send them a notification letting them know a document exists for their approval. That approver can then log into Doclink with their own credentials, click the document note of their choosing, and approve or deny the document using the note. If they didn't want to approve nor deny this document, they could instead add an info note indicating next steps for review. Using Doclink, we can see how easy it is to approve invoices. No more missing payment deadlines or early pay discounts, and no more paying late fees. This concludes our video today on Doclink approvals. Please see our other videos to learn more about Doclink functionality. Contact us today to learn more about how we can help you streamline your business processes.